All right, humans, I have returned after our Stanley Cup final defeat to P.K. Subban and the Nashville Predators, Johnny General Zod and the Canadiens. They have all off-season long to think about the mistakes made in that cup final, especially in game number six, where we lost five to four. Man, the simulation just was not on our side. We couldn't get on the right side of the score. And as a 70 overall enforcer, you know, I just felt like I was hand cuffed like my my foot was in a barrel the entire time I was chained down I couldn't get going I, I couldn't pick up the puck and just dominate so I kept on you know forcing plays and turning the puck over and we didn't have time to be playmakers on we didn't have time to body check and try to use our aggression to get our team pumped up we needed to make something happen and it was just impossible at 70 overall I mean it was a good playoff run don't get me wrong Jason Pominville 26 points in 21 games played patch already 25 and 21 Johnny General Zod who was out for uh three games or two games, what, two or three games, 23 points in 18 games played. I mean, we played fantastic there in the, but there in the cup final, man, the Nashville Predators were just the better team, and Carey Price did not have a great cup final. His save percentage for the playoffs was nice, but that was like at 9.35 or 9.40 going into the cup final against the Nashville Predators. He dropped the ball big time, and in game six, like I said, five goals against. It wasn't even an empty netter. We saw all the goof-ups there at the end of the game, Five goals against. So five goals against in game number one. He played great in game two. 3-2 overtime win. Then allowed the overtime winner for Nashville. So you can make the argument he dropped the ball there. Then... Down 2-1 in the series. He has a five-goal against performance again. Game, uh, game number four, he played better, but then five-goal. It was it was the story of the five-goal against series against the uh, Montreal Canadiens here. We just could not stop the Nashville Predators. And like I said, it's time to go golfing in the offseason. So, Johnny General Zod, let us simulate to the end of the year with the NHL entry draft. We'll see if this game has anything new with the offseason. I highly doubt it, but still, we'll go through it. We made it all the way to the Stanley Cup all year long. I watched the ups and downs you went through out there. Then finally, we make it to the Stanley Cup <laughs> registered trademark. Unfortunately, the Montreal Canadiens registered trademark came out on the losing end this year. Keep up the hard work. You helped us get this far. I carried this freaking team. Are you kidding me? You've made us very proud. I've just found out from my source that your name was on the very short list for the Calder Memorial Trophy. I wanted to thank you on behalf of the Montreal Canadiens franchise for your efforts all year you really made us proud with your accomplishments did i win the rookie of the year or was it just on the uh, short list so the stanley cup cha uh, champion the nashville predators at least our ahl squad the lavelle rocket won good for you guys uh since the next season hang on a second is there a way of taking a look at the awards i want to know did i win the award or not this is another thing ea sports remember on old gen you could take a look at your player and what you've accomplished and all that stuff and that would be nice if that made a uh, return, but uh, maybe in NHL 2025. Art Ross goes to Patrick Kane. Hart, Patrick Kane. James Norris, Brent Burns. Lady Bing, Patrick Kane. Calder Memorial goes to Dylan Strom. So Dylan Strom uh, edges out Johnny General Zod for the Calder. Let's take a look at these stats here. What the hell? I didn't win the freaking Calder. Uh, rookie skaters, Johnny General Zod. If I look around the entire league, uh, we had an outstanding playoff run, but yeah, during the regular season, uh, the points were few and far between. Just missed out on it. 39. I still should have got it. This stupid freaking game. Minus 13 for Dylan Strom. 42 points, 11 goals, and 82 games played. I had, I had 11 games less, 71 games played, and only three points left, but more goals, and a plus 11, and 304 penalty minutes. How are you going to take the Calder away from Krypton's military leader? That is sacrilege, boys. The NHL, I'm telling you, they're bought and paid for. The Zebras there in games one, uh, games uh, four, and game six. And now the Calder taken away from the general. Unreal. So let's sim to the next season. See if anything pops up. Uh, ooh, you know what? Always auto-assign training. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Maybe that's why Johnny General Zod is only still 70 overall. Was I skipping training the entire year? <laughs> I hate the training in this game. It was so much better on old gen. Now you, you could just apply the training points to whatever statistic you want. Now you got to do some stupid Gatorade practice program per week where your overall slightly goes, oh, you know what? You know what? You know what? Let's keep it positive. If something pops up here in the offseason, I'll bring it back, boys. But I am pretty sure we are simulating all the way to preseason. So let's jump there, shall we? Okay, I was right. Not a single thing popped up there in preseason or in the offseason. 
And now we are in preseason. Johnny General Zod is 71 overall. Hell yeah, boys. Slowly, slowly going up. Now, hang on a second. Let's take a look at our uh, individual stats. See where we got our player growth here. So, shooting is uh, 78, 79, 79, 77. So, our shots are getting slightly better. Puck skills. Okay, we got a long way to go there. So, I'm still going to be lo losing the puck every time I pick it up. Puck control, deking, hand-eye. Uh, senses, offensive awareness up at 80. Skating, where's my speed? 78 so I still have no speed whatsoever <laughs> oh my god my physical category hell yeah body checking up at 97 so anyone who wants to uh get in my way watch out it's like a freight train hitting you and defense defensive awareness 79 stick checking 78 okay so I don't want to do any preseason games this year hopefully I can just simulate through preseason uh in fact that's what we're going to do right now I do want to take a look at the new uh, Montreal Canadiens in case we signed anyone or traded for anyone, but just in case those players are not scratched until the first game of the season, let us simulate to that, shall we? I have high hopes for you this year. Good to see your face again after these past few months of downtime. Playing that golf, General Man, uh, GM Burge, no, it's not Burge Man, somebody else. Shortly, we'll be heading into the preseason, and you'll be meeting your teammates from Le Montreal Canadiens and Lavelle Rocket organization. The coach will fill you in on the plans for the roster. They better not freaking send me down to Lavelle if I skip every preseason game. It's that hectic time of the year again where we try to figure out who is good enough to play for the Montreal Canadiens and who stays with Lavelle for a more seasoning. Your slot on the pro roster is assured. Boom! Is assured, baby. Good. EA Sports, thank you. We don't need some General Zod from 2016 again. But I still recommend to get to know your teammates here. Screw that. Lavelle, they may have done well down there in the AHL, but as long as Palmonville, you know what, Palmonville might not even be on the team anymore. We, when we traded for him, it was a rental player, right? One year left. <laughs> Jason Palmonville. Maybe we have a legitimate first-line center now. Maybe the team made some trades in the offseason. We'll have to wait and see. So, uh, should I wait here and trying to vamp or should I just use some power of video editing? You know what? Power of video editing. Okay, so it's the start of the regular season. Not a bad preseason. Four and three, I think we were. Bunch of overtime wins as well. Yeah, only one regulation win. But uh, that doesn't matter. It's preseason. In game number one, opening night, we're traveling to Toronto against our rivals, baby. The Toronto Maple Leafs. So view lines. Let's see what we have here. All right, so we got Max Pacioretty, Brendan Gallagher, and Johnny General Zod on the first line. Second line, you got Jonathan Druin, Alex Galchenyuk, and Arturi Lekkinen. So welcome Lekkinen to the, to the squad. Jason Palmanville is still here, boys. They re-signed him. I wonder, one year, 3.1 million. Good. Philippe Dano, Andrew Shaw. Is that Brian, Brian fucking Giant? <laughs> He's back! Yeah, Brian Gianta in Montreal once again. Andreas Martinson and Alesh Hemsky, man. All right, so Patch Reddy, Gallagher, and Zod. We're going to have to tear it up. Second line is looking good, though, with Druin, Galchenyuk, and Lekkonen. And then, of course, Palmanville is Palmanville. But it looks like we're not playing together this year. And defensively, looks weak. So we didn't make any trades that uh, really improved our squad. Uh, Davidson, Hudon, and uh, Jelena are the scratch players. And the goaltender, it's still Carey Price as a exact franchise. So a very similar team. But uh, now I got Gallagher with Patch Reddy on the first line. The good news that Patches is that left-handed shot. And and I believe Gallagher is a right-handed, correct? Oh, man. I'm second-guessing myself now. Gallagher's right-handed. Hang on. All right. Yeah. So we got the right-handed shot from Gallagher, left-handed shot from Patch already, which means I can find a 1T and Shea Weber is still back there. But we didn't pick up any stud, you know, defender or another winger out there to help us out. Oh, well. So here it is, opening night, year number two. Johnny General Zod, his rookie season is done. Now it's time we start producing. Those kind of numbers that we put up during the playoffs, let's put that up all regular season long and dominate, baby, win some awards. So we're going to do what we do uh, in every single game, first and second period, then jump in for the third. Opening night in the Air Canada Center, original six, the, the, the Ontario-Quebec rivalry. First period goes to Toronto. Austin Matthews in his third year, and Morgan Riley open up the goal scoring for the Toronto Maple Leafs. Second period. Yeah, baby. La Canadiens de Montreal. I've tied it up. Arturi Lekkonen and Andreas Martinson. A 2-2 game. 24 shots to 19 in favor of Montreal. Let's go. So, here we are, ladies and gents. Opening night in the Air Canada Center. We got a great third period in store for you tonight. The Toronto Maple Leafs and the Montreal Canadiens are tied 2-2. Two two. Oh, William Nylander. I was going to body him. But like I said, I want to be dominant this year. I want point production. William Nylander 
land around the net. Johnny General Zog going back there to help out with the poke check. Yeah, baby. Selky trophy. Now, no penalty here. Morgan Riley, where are you going? Oh, he cuts around the general. Let's go for the body check. Trying to utilize that stick check maybe a little bit more, Johnny General Zod. Don't just go for the bodies every single time. William Nylander coming around. Oh! I shall know the ball, Zod. Morgan Riley back to Jake Gardner. Jake Gardner down low to Austin Matthews. Broken up again by Zod. Max Pacioretty's going to break it. I am so slow, but I'm darting to the net, Patches. Oh, Pacioretty with the windmill right into Morgan Riley, and that's going to be the rush. Johnny General Zod going for a quick change. Let's not get caught, boys. It's a 2-2 game. Oh, man. Olsner, he just wrecked. Uh, was that Austin Matthews got wrecked? Good. Matthews, get used to that shit. And we may be here in the Air Canada Center, but game two is the Bell Center. All right. So, 1847. Looks like we have a sim goal, and it is for the home team. The Toronto Maple Leafs take a 3-2 lead here in the third period. I wonder who got the goal. All right. Come on. And also with Gallagher, I wonder if he's going to be uh, much better than uh, Palmanville at faceoffs. He might be. i got to take a look at their individual stats after to know. Uh, but still against the Leafs, Matthews might have a better faceoff rating. And Kadri too. Here we go. Petrie breaking it up for Montreal. Gallagher on the right side. Number 11. Deeks to the inside. Finds Pacioretty on the backhand. Tries to go backhand low blocker. That's an interesting one. Pacioretty back to the point. Jordy Ben over to Petrie. Petrie clap bomb from the point. Just misses the net. Here we go. Oh, I just missed Patty Marlowe. Uh, here we go. Patri oh, Pacioretty just misses me. Ah, and it's going to be offside right now. Uh, you know, there's a little bit of off-season rust on both teams. The puck was right there. Pacioretty just couldn't find me. And look at him. I want Pacioretty taking a wrist shot right there. Why are you putting the puck on your backhand just to go back short side? Rip that sucker top shed on your forehand, my man. You got the shot, Pacioretty. 32 seconds into this shift. Zod trying to get in there. Yeah, another poke check off of Mitch Marner this time. Oh, get that puck. Get that puck, Patches. There you go. Patch ready. Doing his job. Find Schlemko. I got to get back and help out. Yeah, I got to get back. For some reason, our defenseman pinched up right there. And Patch ready was in the exact same position. Marner goes down. Drew in. Find Schlemko. Zod's going to go for a, a bad line change. Get the hell out of here. Andrew Shaw. Wrist shot. Good save there by Freddy. Keeps his team in the lead with a 3-2 score. 14 minutes left here in the third period. Down to 11-22. Time's running out for the Canadiens. If I said, if I can follow through on what I said, I need to be the one to score the goal here. The big-time performer. Jordy Ben finds Patch already. What a save. Man, that was a rebound in front. I thought that was going to be a computer goal for sure. That's a penalty. You damn right, Zebras. Way to go. Patch already draws one. Uh, Petrie finds Ben. Finds Zod. Back to Petrie. Trying to get to my forehand shot. Oh, in the middle. Gallagher. Oh, hang on, hang on. I don't like this. I don't like this. I do not like this. Spreading it around nicely. Back to me. Ah, couldn't get in there. We have the extra attacker, but there's 11 skaters right there in the uh, in the offensive zone. That's a lot to deal with, and I still don't have the hands and my, my reach. My range and my reach. But we got the power play. What we needed to tie this game up. Oh, man. We just killed Jake the Snake as well. I shouldn't have skipped. Pacioretty was right there in a golden spot. 10-38 down to 9-38. Alright, so a perfect power play right here. One minute for both squads. Here we go. Back in the uh, in the Montreal Canadian zone. Picked up by Petrie. He's going to break it up to Alex Galchenyuk. Oh, I'm out here with Galchenyuk and Patch already on the left side. Wrist shot. That's what I want. Rebound. Ooh. Now, I will be taking more uh, shots myself off the rush. But if I have Patch already on my left side, flying down the left wing, he's getting that puck. That is his shot to take. And also, I mean, I can get open because on that left-handed shot, I can trail back top of the circle and look for a one-timer if he doesn't have the shot. That is the play, boys. I'm doing it. As we see Freddie Anderson on fire so far in this period, making three saves, keeping his team in the lead. All right, boys, we're going to have to find a way through Freddie. Face-off win. Is that Philippe Dano? Philippe Dano. I'm out here with Philippe Dano and Gallagher now. Oh, Jerry, there you go. Oh, I couldn't get it. Oh, pfft. Flings it off the boards. Good clear right there. All right, all right. Power play specialist to Petrie. Petrie in the middle. Wrist shot. Couldn't get it through. Oh, boys. Jerry is going to fling it out. I know everyone wants me shooting it more, but I'm not forcing shots, okay? I'm still going to pass it when I feel like a computer has a great chance to shoot. And Petrie did right there. Gallagher. Now to me. Now to me. Yes. Power. Ah! Zod with the whiff. I can't even take a slap shot in this goddamn game. Oh, uh, going for a line change. Let me just get off. Oh, my God. All right, relax. The voodoo feeds on the rage. Relax. Maybe I just, maybe I messed up somehow. I, I, I took too long to take a slap shot. Okay, 749 left. 
That's exactly what I'm talking about, though. See how Gallagher took it in? And then I was the drop forward. I'll shoot like that. Brian Gionta! Get over here, Gionta! Welcome back! Gionta with the wrist shot! Martinson! Brian Gionta! Oh! Oh! Jones! Oh, man! The wrist shot doesn't go anywhere, though! Zod's in there! Yeah! Poking! A nice little fourth line shift with the former captain, Brian Gionta. Why, Bergevin? Why? <laughs> I know, we lost in the Stanley Cup Final to the Nashville Predators. We need some veteran leadership. Get our hands on Brian Gianta. We're for sure going to win the Cup this year. Unreal. Bergevin, he sure knows how to construct a team, let me tell you. Uh, 434 remaining here in the third period. This might be, uh, I wouldn't say it's my last shift, but last full strength shift. Full uh, stamina shift. Fucking Joffrey Lupo! <laughs> Lupul playing for the Leafs. Oh, man, he gets wrecked. He's going to be injured again. Schlemko up to Gallagher. Galli G, baby. Galli G on the run. Oh, man, he cut back instead of just continuing left, then passing it right. Moro, wrist shot, almost got it through right there. Hartnell. Hartnell down, baby. Aja, no, the ball's on. Poke check. There it is. Anderson. Hey, got the face off. Got the face off. Good job. Pacioretty hunting down the puck right there. If Anderson made a mistake, Patches, our captain, was right there to jump on it. I'll get him a shift. 402. Down to 102. All right, this good job, coach. Good job. You uh, you timed it right with the first line this time. 57 seconds left. The Montreal Canadiens are on the attack. Oh, wrist shot. Oh, wrist slap shot gets deflected. Should I go? Oh, oh, Gallagher. Oh, yeah, yeah. Back to Weber. Back to Galli G. Finds Zod. No, I don't have it. I do not have it right now. Oh, oh slap shot gets blocked by JVR Shaft. Step up, Alsner. Step up, Alsner. Don't let him shoot. There you go. Around the net. Around the net. Around the net. We gotta cut him off. I'll show you guys how to freaking defend. Empty net. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm right here for you. Yeah, baby. Over to the right side. Wide open. Here we go. Galli G. Drop past to me. Drop past to me. Oh, patch ready. Gallagher! Yeah, baby! And the Montreal Canadiens have tied it up. Et la boo! 29.6 seconds left. Take that, Toronto. You pieces of shit. You perennial, uh, what's it called? Over, underachievers. You scoundrels. Brendan Gallagher to Pacioretty. I was almost going to do a drop pass, but there was already three forwards in the zone. I'm not going to do a drop pass to a fourth forward. Pacioretty found Gallagher. Right-handed shot. Lefty to righty. Wide open net. And we got ourselves a tie game. Beautiful. All right, Gallagher. I love myself some Pominville, but... Uh, you know, I could get on board with Brendan Gallagher as well here, boys. All right, Zod. Ooh, Zod. Zod. Patch ready. Sauce. Oh, man, Marner. Marner, Mitch Marner. He's shifty. Oh, up to William Nylander. Over to Austin Matthews. They're loading up. They want this game late. They don't want to go to overtime. Oh, in the middle. Slut go. Good save. All right. Oh, man. Indigestion. Slemko. Let's go. Here we go. Over to Zod. Power. Ah, oh, I can't take a slap shot. I cannot take it. Like, the game doesn't let me take a slap shot. Unreal. Seven seconds left. It could all be my fault. P Price! Price the... Fuck you, Nylander! Get the fuck away from my goalie! That's right! And because he hit the puck, it's no penalty. 2.8 seconds left here in the third. And uh, Carey Price does his job. Alright, we're gonna have to watch it, boys. This could be the game. 2.8 seconds left. Come on now. Don't goof it up. Bozak takes a shot. What a face-off. Dynamo able to actually would not only win the face off but get a shot off on the net. I think he had enough time to win it back and shoot it, but whatever. All right, so man, Anderson is playing great. Forty-one shots, only three goals of four. Carey Price, let's go, my man. And Zod is out there to take the face off. <laughs> All right, just push. Just push. You're not going to be able to win it straight up. Patch ready, one on one. Got your left side. Okay, he's going to the right side. Pat, drop. You power. Ha! Huh! Oh my god, I waited. I tried to... I, man, I have no, no accuracy at all. Oh man, Selkie Trophy. Three on one with the Enforcer back. Austin Matthews over to William Nylander. William Nylander finds Austin Matthews. Ooh, good save there by Carey Price. Oh, I don't know. The bomb. Oh, what the fuck was that? I just turned my agility. It's uh, And the turning radius is massive. Morgan Riley finds Austin Matthews. Oh, toe drag. Back to Riley. Back to Matthews. Oh, great save in front by Carey Price. Here we go. Shay. No, 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 no. I want that puck. There you go, Shay. Up to me. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here, patches. Dart. Dart. Dart patches. Dart. Uh, wrist shot. Short side. Ooh, just missed that crossbar. A little light. move, you idiots. Back check. Morgan Riley up to William Nylander. All right, Weber. We got this. Weber. Left side. Weber. Left side. Weber. There you go. Yeah, get to that left side. I got the right. Oh uh, no, no, no. Oh man, that was my fault. He got through. All right, we're going. I got uh, Johnny Drew in with me. All right, Drew in. I'll set you up. I'll set you up. I'll set you up, Johnny. Go, go, Drew in. Go, Drew in. Go. Boom. There it is. Oh, the rebound! No! It does not go in! Morgan Riley knew before the general. I'm staying out here, coach. I got the magic touch. Drew in to Zod. Back door! Oh, my God! Petrie, you goof! 
Uh, yeah, I'll go for a line change. Whatever. Horrible change right there. Coach is going to be angry at me. Back checking. Oh, oh, Carey Price with the cross crease save. 305 left here in overtime. Do we have a sim goal? No, we don't. One minute left. And the coach is putting me back out there. He knows. He knows. All right, face off. You just don't want to lose it clean. Push. Don't lose it clean. Don't, oh, fuck. I lost it clean. Kadri went back to that side. Thank God. Gardner! <laughs> You're garbage at defense, buddy. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Zod. Oh, the puck is... Oh, I can't. I can't. Oh, back to the point. There you go. Petrie. Back to Zod now. Ooh, shot. Okay, okay. Not a lot of... Uh, we get the offensive zone face off, I shall know. There we go. Oh, Gardner. How about you pass it up the boards? Oh, my God. So it, it stops him from being able to check him because he wants to talk to me face to face. I should just be able to punch through that. Oh, man, that's it. 47.3 seconds. Hang on, let's watch the offensive zone. Nylander. Now screw that. Ain't watching it now. <laughs> 42 seconds left. Are we going to a shootout? Or do we have... Oh, we got a sim goal! 31 seconds left. And the Canadiens de Montreal come into Toronto on the opening, opening night of the year two season. And they take it in overtime. Good job, Carey Price. We still gave a point to a divisional rival, but uh, game one of the season, way too early to start thinking about <laughs> the standings. I'm just glad we got the W. So, uh, yeah, my voice, even though we did uh, the offseason, let's get one more game in. And... Uh, and uh, we'll call it, a, call it a video after that. So here we go. Game in Pittsburgh. Rematch of round number one last year in the Eastern Conference. And the Montreal Canadiens, we have been on a tear this year. We are undefeated 4-0. and oh. I do some simulating, boys. I like to sim two or three games uh, between each just be, <laughs> so we can get a regular season done. And uh, we're 4-0. and oh. And in this game, the simulation was great to us as well. 3 nothing lead. So let's just have some fun in this one. Let's, uh, we can even be the enforcer because we're already down. Oh, great simulation. Down to 1931. There you go. Oh, and somehow I magically transport myself to the bench. All right, let's go, boys. Oh, shit. Hang on a second. All right, we're good. Oh, that's a penalty. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Malkin goes down, and here comes... All right, Cole, in Cole, baby. I think, did we fight? We must have fought. I, I, I think it was Inko who injured me in round number one. Let's go, Inko. Let's go. I'm going to just dang him a little bit. There you go. Got him hooked. Oh, no, he's not hooked. Shit, uppercut. Ooh, in Cole. I debucketed him here. Here we go. No, no, no. Throw punch. Throw punch. He's, he'd be throwing weird punches, baby. Overhand uppercut. Look at him. He's dodging everything. Would you throw a punch? There you go. Now it's time for you to nail before that general. Look at him there, boys. I shall know the ball's on. Just like that. No problem whatsoever. Just another night here in the NHL for Johnny General Zod. Absolutely. Rex Gino Malkin and then tosses Ian Cole. Yeah, it's time to serve five minutes in the penalty box, but we're up 3 nothing, so it doesn't matter. Uh, I don't want to become... I was reading your comments. You guys want... The uh, the sniping Zod. I know, too much passive passing in the playoffs. You guys want Zod to dominate. I want to dominate, don't get me wrong, but uh, I still want to be the enforcer. It's fun. <laughs> Malkin! Oh, that is a great save there by Carey Price. Malkin got the pass, cut quickly to his left, and shot back uh, to his right side. Uh, Carey Price was moving from his left to his right. The shot came back to his left, and he had to be quick on that one. Threw up the glove, made a great save. No rebound either. Was able to snag it. Malcolm with the faceoff. Second line's out there. Uh, Brennan Gallagher up to Alsner. Oh, Haglin steals it off Alsner. The horrible spot. Spot, and here goes uh, the Montreal Canadiens. Weber up to Zod over to Gallagher. Gallagher over to Patches. Patches over to Zod. Oh my God, it's beautiful. Thank you, Patcheretti. Thank you, Gallagher. I won't even celebrate. That was all you guys. Ah. Jeannot d'avant les Montreal Canadiens, baby. First goal of the season. All right, so I didn't even get a sim goal up until this point. That was a great play. I dropped it back to the third man. See what I mean about Pacioretty? Left-handed shot on that left side. You got to give it to him. When he's got the defender beat, he's got the short side shot. And if the other right winger or center or second forward can get to the back post before the right defenseman, then the cross crease is available. That's a beautiful play. Get the hell out of here, Matt Murray. Just in Jerry with his uh with his AHL mask is starting or not starting he's being put in there oh man that's bad why would you pull him now fourth goal with like 11 minutes left like why I mean it was three nothing well that wasn't even that bad of a goal man it was a cross crease here we go Zod oh Justin no, I'm, I'm slower I'm slower but I'm heavier oh there we go delay panel oh hang on hang on hang on where are you <laughs> welcome to the game Tristan Jerry there you go <laughs> Oh, you're up? No, you're not, you little bitch! There you go, up again! No, bitch ass! <laughs> Seven minute power play! Oh, Johnny General Zod! You are not allowed to do that! What has gotten into the general? 
Oh, he's so pissed off from losing the Stanley Cup. He's all he's only been thinking about that in the offseason. And now oh, oh Goltee's gone! What did I do? Oh my god, I've been ejected. So I guess the uh did I injure the goalie or I must have injured. <laughs> what happened? Hang on. Hang on, ladies and gents. <laughs> the Sportsnet or the uh, TSN moment. We've got to go back and take a look at what happened. So did... Uh, <laughs> I knew I... Literally, this is so bad. This is so calculated. I would be suspended. I would be ejected from the NHL for doing this. All right, so you're chasing down the puck. You realize, oh, I'm not fast enough, so I'll stop. <laughs> so I can create a gap. And then I'll start skating again. And then just in the numbers, <laughs> charge... I don't think he's injured from that. Is Schultz injured from that? I don't think he's injured from that. If he is injured, that's the, uh... If he is injured, that's the five. I wonder if I injure the goalie. I turned around, <laughs> level Tristan Jerry. <laughs> and he got up. Fuck that! You get injured again! No, he's getting up. He's not getting injured. <laughs> Oh, the referee's like, yo, buddy, you all right? <laughs> that, was, that, was, that looked bad. You all right there, my man? <laughs> just, just, what the fuck? He's going to let him do that to me? And Zod's like, what do I do? That's just hockey, right? Oh, man, hang on a second. That is the thumbnail to this video. <laughs> Johnny General Zod just wrecking goaltenders. Boom, baby. Hang on. <laughs> there it is. Tristan Jerry getting leveled by the general. Oh, I got, I got, yeah, yeah. Oh! God damn glass. It's in the worst spot imaginable. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> I'll get it later. There it is. There it is. Johnny General Zod. <laughs> the smug look on his face as well. <laughs> All right. So I've been ejected. You can continue to watch or quit. <laughs> Let's sim to the remainder of the game. So I played game number one. Then I sim three games. Then I came back in for game number five and I get ejected. <laughs> hey, but Carey Price gets the shutout. So it seemed like it worked. So boys, you let me know what kind of Johnny General Zod you want to see. Uh, I know you guys want me to take more shots. My shooting accuracy is all over the place. I'll be the third forward into the zone more often. And when I am, I'll call for it and go for slap shots. But when Pacioretty is on that left side, I'm giving it to him. He's got the speed. He's got the shot. And you saw right there. Oh my god, Zod. <laughs> These are actually replays at the end of the game. I think I injured Tristan Jerry. Jerry is bringing us the cup. Shut up, you idiots. All right, so let me know what you guys think. Look at these instant replays. Oh, get on your shit, EA. Hey, guys. Johnny here, and thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give us a like, hit that subscribe button, and make sure notifications are on so you don't miss out on any new content. You can also swing by our website, which has forums and a live chat. That along with Twitter allows us to play with our subscribers in our GTA lobbies or the 24-7 open Minecraft server where you can build with others or play in one of the many, many games across Superbia. Our Patreon account helps us support our website and the Minecraft server, and we also live stream on Twitch where I take days off my life for your entertainment. Sonny Gray, get out of it. You stupid pieces of s***! I should have gone with Jose for Fernandez. Oh my God. Pitching change. Fernandez, get your ass in there. Oh, I swear to God. Baseball God just decided to all over me. Grand slam. Oh yeah. Make me miss the playoffs with a first ranked team. Year two, 30 games above 500. No divisional win. Trip to the wild card. First inning.